understand what colonization is about. Colonization for indigenous people is about displacing people's land. And in order to displace people's land, you have to destroy their culture and destroy their political will. And in my lifetime, in protests that I've been at, whether it's been in Burn Church or Band leaders say the actions of those officers yesterday during a violent confrontation at sea were not only reckless, they were criminal. They're images that have grabbed the attention of the country. A small boat with native fishers is run down by a larger federal patrol boat. As the smaller boat begins to sink, the other turns and comes at it again, forcing the people on board to leap into the water. And one officer appears to lean out of his boat and beat doorward with a baton. Although they're not ready to pass judgment on their officers yet, even fisheries officials admit yesterday's raid looked bad. What we've seen is extremely un-Canadian, and it's not the Canadian way to uh, maintain the peace in Canada. But that morning when they ran my friends over, it was something else. Watch your oh, Right behind him. Holy fuck, they're trying to ram him? Holy fuck! Him. Doctor, I was on the boat with uh, with Danny. We we got swarmed, and uh, the UFO pretty much ran over us. They they hit me on the back a few times. And they were trying to hit me in the face, but I, I ducked. When we got towards the boat, I, uh, I shouted at my brother Brian to uh, to pull him up. And he was trying to pull him up, but these, these uh, officers were hitting us with batons, preventing us from picking him up in the water. So he was really struggling for his life here. Should the RCMP not proceed, proceed with laying charges, we'll be left with the definite proof that there are two levels of laws in Canada. One for the First Nations, one for the other Canadians. 